Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing? Man, it's here. Hey, what's going on, guys? How we doing? Man, it's here. Today, we're looking at the top five players in the MLB that are under 25 years old. This is my list. I want to know what you guys think about my list. And if you disagree, put who you think are the top five players in the MLB under 25 years years old. It's a really, really tough list to put together, but I'll tell you what, there's so many really good, exciting young players in the big leagues. The big leagues are, it's in a great spot moving forward with how much talent is in the league and is very young. So let's get to my list right now. All right, so number five, we're going to go with Dustin May, 22 years old, and he is electric. He can throw 100 miles an hour. His ball runs like crazy, nasty curveball, good cutter, can throw it you know, in the mid-90s. His ball looks like a wiffle ball coming in. It's, it's, it looks unhittable, plus he has amazing hair. And so I'm going to have him as number five. Now, number four, Luis Robert, 23 years old, uh, five-tool guy, like Tatis. Uh, from the very first moment I watched this guy play in the big leagues, I mean, I could tell he's going to be a superstar. I think most people can tell that he's going to be a superstar. He's a physical, physical specimen. He's an absolutely amazing athlete. People are already calling him the next Mike Trout. And although he has a long way to go, obviously, until we can officially call him that, he has the tools and the ability to do it. There's nothing on the field that he can't do. He's a special player. He makes amazing plays defensively. He hits the ball 500 feet, and he's making solid contact all the time. So I have him at number four. At number three, we're going to go Ronald Acuna, 22 years old. He won the Rookie of the Year in 2018. He almost went 40-40 in 2019, and he did start off this season slow, but he turned it on at the end of the year. He's one of the most exciting players in baseball. Uh, I'm going to keep him at number three. When you get to these top players, it's tough. I think they're all interchangeable, but I'm going to go with him at number three. I think he's going to continue to have crazy years. He's going to always be a guy that's that has the potential to be a 40-40 guy because he can really run and obviously has amazing power. So we'll keep him at number three. At number two, man, this was tough. I went back and forth with this one too. We're going to go with Fernando Tatis Jr., 21 years old. So fun to watch. Maybe my favorite guy to watch. He's electric in every area of the game. He's got power. He can hit for average. He can run. He can play defense. He can throw. He makes highlight plays all over the place. He is a true five-tool player. People throw that word around a lot, but he is a true five-tooler. He's the first player in history with 30 homers and 20 steals through his first 100 games. He's going to hit a lot more homers and a lot more stolen bases. He is awesome. And so he's at number two. And number one is going to be Juan Soto, 21 years old. He came up to the big leagues and he started dominating right away, right at 19 years old. How That's just mind-boggling to think about. He won a World Series at 20 years old. And now at 21, he absolutely dominates the league. One of the best offensive players in the game. Now, his game's all about offense. But it is so, so good. He is so, so special offensively that I need to put him at number one. Yeah, Fernando Tatis can do a little bit more because he can run and, you know, he play, plays crazy defense. Um, but Soto is such a great hitter. I think he is going to crush the baseball for a long, long, long time. He hits for super high average. He has a ton of power. He gets on base a ton. He has a great eye. He has, a great, he has an approach of a veteran player at such a young age. So I'm going to have him at number one. So that's all we have. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Give it a thumbs up. Share with all your friends. All that good stuff. And we will talk to you later.